I worked for 22 years in the music business and I loved every minute of it. Working in the music business really taught me about the power of story. In the music business, a story is three minutes long and working with artists and musicians and songwriters and film composers and being exposed to capturing that kind of story was immensely powerful uh, for me. I opened an artist management firm when I was really young in Los Angeles and represented this diverse roster of unique talent. It was amazing because I represented the same people for 20 years. And in the music business, that doesn't really happen, but it happened to me. We had this great partnership. And I think as much as I was helping them, they were helping me. You know, managing success is easy. Managing failure is more difficult. <laughs> um, and working in the music business taught me how to manage failure. And that was something that prepared me for being a writer. And after the 20 years managing success and failure, I came to my greatest challenge. Um, one of the artists that I had managed since they were teenagers, they were about to go on this big tour and in a matter of five seconds, everything changed when I got a phone call that the drummer in this band could not feel the left side of his body. Long story short, he was diagnosed with brain cancer. And I had managed success, I had managed failure. We sprang into action, and I was going to manage brain cancer. The diagnosis was wrong, we were gonna get another opinion. Um, and I went through all of this, literally thinking that I was gonna manage death. Unfortunately, I was unsuccessful. Um, and Alan passed away, you know, and he was only in his 30s. Um, he was a rock star, and when he fell ill, everything was taken care of. He had great health insurance. He had great life insurance. He had a daughter that was really, really important. When he took his last breath, his brothers, the band members, same band for 20 years, they were by his side. And after 20 years, I consider that like one of my greatest accomplishments. And it was one of the times that I was like, I knew. I'm a really good manager. <laughs> I'm a really good manager. And I also knew at that moment that I was done. And I knew that there was another calling, that I had my own story to tell. And that's when I really started writing in earnest. So good to see you. Ruda, our manager for, for so many years, and she's here tonight representing all the way from Nashville. I love you.